can you address the calls for resignation for one of your members, Representative Mary Franzen, and, and the video that she made last week? Well, you know, I think it's, again, uh, there was a speech on the floor yesterday about things that were covered and things that weren't covered. And, you know, I, people make mistakes. It's, uh, you know, sometimes they uh, end up on video, probably now more than ever. She's apologized. She's apologized back home to her constituents. Uh, I think that's good enough for me, and uh, I stand by her. Did she make a mistake? Well, that's what she said. I, I will take her out of work. You think she made a mistake? Yeah. She admitted to it, and she said, I'm sorry, and we move on. God help us or everybody here who makes a mistake is each time is told to resign from their office. I don't think she actually has really apologized. She apologized, um, you know, in a uh, Michelle Bachman kind of way, uh, in a non-apology. Uh, the thing that she should be most, the thing that she doesn't get about this has nothing to do with the policy about what she articulated. Uh, there's a debate that can be had over that. That's where she wants to take this. The thing that, that is wrong about what she said is that she was making fun of Minnesotans who are less fortunate than her. She was making fun of poor people. And we don't do that in Minnesota. It violates basic decency. And for some reason, she can't understand that that's the, that's the case. And worse than that, now she is going out there pretending that she is actually the victim in some sense and raising money off of this. So it's just a classic politician's move. Uh, it's unfortunate that she's taken that tack with this. I wish she would just come forward and acknowledge I shouldn't have made fun of poor people and we could move on and actually have the policy discussion she claims she wants to have. Should she resign? No, uh, I don't think she needs to resign. I think the voters will say something about that come November. 